Alright, guys. I'm back. Let's do this. The lost chest clear. Well, I'm really happy I at least beat Dark Room tonight. Um, let alone no Holy Mantle and no Dead Cat. Uh, I mean, I might use Alt F4 so I can get to the basement 2 Devil Room. Then maybe, hopefully, this run I'll get better Angel Rooms. suck. This treasure room's gonna suck. Alright, let's go. Uh, yeah, it did suck. Well, I might as well take it. Lesson is, kids, that mentality doesn't always work. Gold tunnel? Good. I have cellar, not good, but I mean, the haunt has not shown up for very. I mean, now he's gonna show up because I mentioned his name. But yeah, now I'm motivated to actually complete the chest. The chest is easier than the darker by a long shot. So, provided I get another really good run like I did last time, I will probably be good. Considering I didn't mess up Alta 4. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna use Alta 4 unless the run looks really shitty when it's like Caves 2. Because I want to see what's in the basement 2 double room. And not have a negative 1 win streak. Because that'd just be sad, man. Negative 2 win streak, lost only runs? That's just. I mean, a 2 win streak, lost only runs? That's just great. Oh, I never got the buffer save, dang it. Oh yeah, Curse the Unknown, another curse that doesn't affect me at all. So now I have to start pull 4 over again, because I forgot to buffer save. That's what I'll just call it. Man, now I know exactly where everything's at. And then a dot head will be in the rotation, provided I complete something tonight. I completed all tonight. And Godhead will probably show up too. If I seriously beat the Lost... Um... If I seriously full clear the Lost tonight, I will, like, scream. And I don't get Holy Mana War Dead Cat. <laughs> the Alta 4 is working out great for me. I already know what's in here. Uh, might as well buffer save now. And I did get a water. <sighs> what the heck? Where's the, sp the tail thing? It's gone. Now it's back. Yeah. I like a lot of the champion ideas. Like the uh, ones that respawn. I don't like the exploding ones. Because then of course there's always the... Nubs. Just make the nubs not be able to have champions. This is a key and a bomb. Oh, didn't give a bomb? No. Must have gotten that as a drop from an enemy or was not that pot or something. Yeah, but at least my uh, lost the uh, post-it note looks way better now. <sighs> and I'm totally gonna screen cap if I'm not godhead. I mean, I just feel really positive now because I took care of the worst of these, and I got 
the two of the three Trinity items that are really good is the loss. Especially the soul. The body is useless. <laughs> Let's face it, it's useless as the lost. Isaac's heart would also be actually not that good. I should have buffer saved before the boss room. Whatever, widow I can deal with. Uh Black Widow, maybe. <laughs> I mean, I could just lead him to crush and stuff. Like, I heard a lot of people had trouble with the Widow and Ratho Lamb, when really, I have n never had trouble with him. That's just a luck up. I was afraid it was gonna be an evil up because that's just gonna mess up the angels' rooms or angel rooms provided the devil room. On this floor doesn't suck. Cellar again? Really? Maybe I should take the risk and like check the curse room. I could always alt. Actually, uh, um. Yeah, that should have restarted the floor because I didn't buffer save in the curse room. Well, let me just make sure that that worked. If it did, then I could uh, blow up the blue fires, see if dead cat is inside. And... Uh, then... Oh, fuck. Curse you! Basement, that's better. Whatever. Didn't make any progress. And Midas Touch is not exactly the greatest item to start off with is the Lost. better to get the basement though uh, uh yeah this is one of those rooms enemy spam after this all I'll probably go ahead and do the next mega party video because we have all the way through eight recording Infinity, hopefully, this weekend. Because I feel like I've got really nothing to do. That's why I'm playing as Lost. <laughs> or I'm just being a jerk. Maybe my good feelings through this game will come back once I full clear the loss. I dread the expansion though. Because then I have to play as this guy again. I think what I'll just do for the expansion is get a feel, find new floors and stuff, and then immediately play as the loss. Probably not be removed or changed in the expansion. Oh, well, if he does, then. Um, and I already have Wheel Platinum God, then I'm gonna be happy. Did I say Wheel Platinum God? Wheel Platinum God! Eh. Uh, 
should look for a hey, the treasure room and oh yeah chub dislikes oh it's a race it's a race is that is that a new seed i want to write that down Hey, if anybody's listening and has Isaac, maybe, and is not doing a run right now, could you see if, uh, it, what Issa Race does? Because I don't think I've heard about that seed before. Uh, then it turns out, uh, nothing. Uh, I have to this, so I will see what the Issa Race seed does. Considering how, uh, um, uh, what's, how do I put this? Uh... Uh, no, I'll just say it's huge the Isaac community is. They probably already found it. <coughs> oh, I actually got a positive pill for once. Too bad I already found the secret room. This room is like the first large room I ever saw. Like when I first started playing the game, not in gifts and stuff. First item I ever got was a Rainbow Baby. Why is it in every single one of my lost runs the rubber cement shows up? It's a race, is referring to. Hm. Uh, yeah, that's probably a reference considering how this game loves references. Hell, I mentioned Chubb dislikes smoke earlier. That's usually what appears in the rules card. Oh, damn you. Oh, rat race. <laughs> Lucky rock. Well, this could potentially earn me a whole hell of a lot of money. This is actually like the first time I ever really have gotten a chance to use Lucky Rock, because for the longest time, I never knew what it did. Aw, oh, you dicks. Will Bouncy Tears defeat you? At least they're not as bad as the loss, because the creep doesn't matter. Provided I play it safe, and Bouncy Tears doesn't work good. And I uh, may or may not alt it four correctly. Uh, this should be fine. Doing particularly well. I hate uh, I hated the gurglings. Or used to I hate the gurglings. Not I used to safety pin. Well, isn't I don't I I should just go check the Isaac wiki to see if that's even worth it because I don't want to screw up the angel rooms again. I mean, I picked it up before. I just forgot what it did. Evil range and shot speed. Uh, yeah, no thanks to um, mess up the angel rooms. Uh, maybe another day, Sunny. Basement two, good. Like, seriously, I got rubber cement once in a really overpowered Judas run with, like, Proptosis, so I had bouncy Proptosis tears, and that was amazing. That's also the run I first beat Mega Satan in. Um. And, uh, other than that, the only <laughs> times I've seen rubber cement are lost runs. I saw it twice yesterday, and now today. Oh, might as well. Because I have skeleton. Gold skeleton key. What would Monstro's Lung plus Bouncy Tears be like? That would be really fun. Or, God forbid, Tiny Planet plus Bouncy Tears. Did I just like instantly put out the fire? 
I think it's just <laughs> I love how it just bounces in here. soul shows up so I can uh, try him out. I don't like to. <coughs> been coughing a lot. Uh, how can I destroy the most rocks? Oh, wow. That is some trinket. Ooh. I don't like these kinds of rooms. Celtic Cross? Well, I have not seen that item before. I think it's- oh yeah, it's a non-hit item, isn't it? Whatever, but I now have it in my collection, at least. Um, I'd like to find the secret room on this floor. And possibly blow up some rocks in the process. sure if it's worth blowing up the tender dollar. Let's we'll see. Bomb please? Good. Got some money out of it. Cash monies. Secret room should be here. And that'll blow up a rock. No, it's not. Can't be here. <coughs> the only other place I can see it being is uh, in between the sacrifice room and the boss. Bogo bombs. Bogo bombs and bottle pills. I might as well get bogo bombs just so I get a bunch of bombs. Mm, the secret. No, it's actually not there. That's strange. Dangle? Okay, I can deal with you. Oh, I didn't. A buffer save before the boss. Yeah, I could buffer save during the boss, but I feel like I can deal with Dingle. Deal with Dingle, well, my new hit single. So you're just gonna keep shooting at me in that cross pattern, apparently. Well, I wonder how much progress I lost. just outside of the treasure room. Whatever. Um, I really don't feel like going back and just getting bogo bombs. Er, well, actually, that tin rock does give you two bombs, so... Might as well not waste any bombs looking for the secret room. After this, blah, 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 blah. Fourteen coins for uh, next floor, where there's hopefully a better shop. <coughs> Maybe with a humbling bundle or whatever. An item that could actually help is the lost. I mean, Boga Bombs helps, but not really. You know what they should do that would make the Lost way be uh, much better of a character? And maybe even a fun one? Is if, um... The on-hit items like, um... Celtic Cross and, uh, Piggy Bank... Uh, trigger an effect when you get hit, activate at the start of the room. And then stuff like the Ivy Bag, the Blood Banks, um... And Blood Rites... Can be used infinitely. 
Because then there would be a ton of items that would be so much fun to have as the Lost, and it'd actually be tolerable for people that were not were, were, uh, were stopping themselves from using. Um, uh, yeah, shots, stem cell was a uh, shot speed up. <laughs> Devil room? That's not dead cat, so. I'd rather. It's still. That uh, probably is a better devil room to get with the lost. <coughs> but I'd rather. Uh, save chances for the angel rooms. Smite's now playing Overlord 2. You finished the Overlord series, didn't you, Smite? Alright. Try to get some good. Hopefully, maybe Sacred Heart or the Mind or Soul shows up. I mean, considering I got Sacred Heart last run, I shouldn't press my luck. There still could be Mom's Knife. Uh, or. Brimstone. Or brimstone? Not really, because I ignored the first devil room. And an angel room will probably show up because I did not take safety pin in order to not mess up angel rooms. <coughs> I love how uh, the tears are multi hitting him because they're bouncing in the corner. Why did I re enter this room after I ulted forward? Because I died. That was just stupid. Well, I got a key out of it, not something. It's gonna be so weird getting back to playing as regular characters. I mean, I'm talking about like this, like it's a one run. Lovely. Lots of money. And soul hearts I can't use. <coughs> Smite must be doing a stream. Tears. Now this is like the first time I've been actually able to use them. Because in the aforementioned Judas run, I only got them very late. In the other two lost runs, I wasn't using Alt F4, so I wasn't able to experience it fully. Experience the uh, wonderful uh, blessing that is Bounce Tears. Something that needed to happen. Bouncy Tears. Now, if only anything synergized with it, uh, wouldn't that be a thought? <coughs> wouldn't be surprised if I got back to normal runs and then was constantly buffer saving and alt f if I got hit. Because... Uh, I maybe this run might get missed. But so that's only a maybe. I only have bouncy tears, Celtic cross, and the stem cells. This isn't exactly a one run. This is a challenge room. Uh, I am actually. I am my goal for. Uh, my goal is to get real platinum god as soon as possible because I want to. I'll start getting into rebirth modding because that just seems really cool to me. Especially since somebody made a level editor. Uh, and some of the things I probably will end up doing make boss challenge rooms like they were in the original because I missed the boss challenge rooms. They always had a boss item in them in the original. Now they just are the same as challenge rooms. Having a risk versus reward. 
I mean, you could probably yell at me if there's some better reward in the boss challenge rooms, better lit payout or something. <coughs> but they certainly don't feel worth it to me. Nothing special here. This is just a run that I'm surviving thanks to buffer saving and Alta 4. two rooms at a time just so well I'm probably just annoying uh, whoever is watching this by constantly buffer saving but hey you try playing as the lost if I actually win I might just end this with a casual Isaac run uh, strength again oh my old buddy Oh, speak of the devil. Something good. Well, I i mean, it's not good, but at least my attack's high now. I really, I don't like Polyphemus all that much. Actually, Bouncy Tears might work really well with it. Considering now, Polyphemus can hit multiple enemies. And if I get eno enough tears ups... And this could be something wonderful. Um, ton tears ups, bouncy tears, polyphemus. That'll be a fun time. Uh. It was close. I tapped the alt F4 key not hard enough. Whatever. But this looks like it might be something good. Might as well check Twitter in the meantime. Oh yes, yeah, I just said just he's gonna stream World War Two. No, oh, I just heard my iPad go off. Must be uh, Smite is Smite TV is now live. Let's stay away from that guy at a time. There's a store. Three. Purse. And hive mind. I think I'll go for the purse and then donate a little. Uh, cause hive mind is not an item that would <clears throat> necessarily benefit me right now. I mean, it could be could have benefited me later, and I'll face palm or whatever. I could just go buy hive mind right now, just in case something happens. I mean, as long as I have bums in a room with enough rocks, I have money. Sure, I'll take hive mind, just in case something happens, like if I get Guppy's head or something. Okay, no, oh, and it's a big hollow, so I can bounce tears off him like crazy. Bounce, bounce, bounce. Angel room? Yes, please. Now, watch it be Lazarus' rags. Ooh, I, uh, internet blew out for a sec. Well, let's continue this train wreck. 
<coughs> well, now that I don't have any evil ups. Um, the angel room should be showing up fairly often. <coughs> Hoping for Mind Your Soul, since I just unlocked them. How pouncy tears are just multi hitting the enemies. It's great. Wow, bouncy tears works insanely well with Polyphemus. Again, if I get some tears ups, then this could be amazing. But look, it just hit like three of the bats there with one tear. I love bouncy tears. Wow, they're great. <coughs> Or maybe after I do this, I should take care of Demo Man. The challenge that I fear the most. The secret was not there, or I just totally missed the. Mm. Bouncy Tears, save me! <clears throat> or maybe Celtic Cross is a faith up? Maybe? It's not, it's not like I sat down and read the Isaac wiki for 15 hours, I just kind of figured it out, and then, wow, uh, and then items I was particularly confused on, I just looked up. Like, uh, Bogo Bombs. <laughs> I never knew what that did for such a long time. I never figured it out. from the item description that it meant uh, each explosion now was double explosions. Which actually would have been amazing. The iron bar. Concussive tears. Well, this could be really amazing or incredibly dangerous. Considering how boomflies act with concussive tears. But this could throw enemy off track. Wow, that was amazing. Flatworm. Oh yeah. I love you too, Lucky Rock. Might as well. Oh, I lost. Or er, high greed. And uh, he'll just uh, sit over there like an idiot. And I got killed because I got cocky. <clears throat> Alright, let's uh, try that again. Well, actually, I might just not go into the shop, considering that greed is in there. Well, I'll just see what, um... That looks pretty cool. Considering I don't have a space bar item, I sh maybe should take flat worm. And yeah, there I just went in there because of my own volition. Maybe because I'll get a ton of money for the next floor. And because I will absolutely slaughter him. Alright, what's our uh, friend gonna be here?
Dark one? Okay. I mean, I can deal with him. Oh, oh, jeez. Please, Contestive Tears, don't utterly screw up Dark One. When I first thought, saw him, I thought he was gonna be like the Fallen and give you a Devil Room item, and that would've been awesome. Speed up. Ah, uh, yeah, Angel's being an asshole again. Wow, Bouncy Tears works great with uh, these guys. Bounce. Oh, yeah, thanks. Yeah. Bounce. And apparently, Flatworm increases knockback. Uh, red fires quickly with bounce tears. Having so much fun with bounce tears. Oh, look at it go. <laughs> We're just all crowded in the corner. Bounce, 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 bounce. Bounce, go, bounce, young tear. Oh, that was cheesy. <laughs> uh, I love this. Bounce. That's, that's fun. Is fun. Wow, Bounce Tears is amazing. I love it. I've already been doing one hour, thirty minutes. Can't believe I actually unlocked something in that time. Okay, let's try this again. Not do something stupid. Bedroom. Uh, sure. Might as well try gamble. Hopefully, get a clean one. No, a dirt. What? What? What is a uh, the the one of this? Oh, it's a uh, next floor. <laughs> With the, really uh, a bed surrounded in spikes? <laughs> that's just unfair. Actually, that's kind of pointless because getting in the bed will allow you to be fully heal yourself. So, provided you're not one hit away from death, that's <laughs> kind of pointless. Oh, well, you could use a soul, lose a soul heart, but that, yeah, that's just fair to give a middle, good middle finger to you. <laughs> Teratoma is also another thing I was worried about with Concussive Tears. Shop or library? I forgot. Oh, I haven't seen either on this floor so far. 20 minutes already? Oh well. Boss Rush probably wasn't going to help me anyways. Oh, Super Greed? Really? Well, at least I know- at least I have one more shop to myself. And he went down extremely quickly. <coughs> Thanks, Robert Cement. I love you too. <laughs> well, I want to find the treasure room first, so. Uh, Secret might be here. No. Seriously need a place to spend these. 
I mean, I could just go to the next floor and buy out the entire store. Treasure room? Where is the treasure room? Or, oh wait, I don't have treasure map. What am I doing? For some reason I thought I had treasure map for a second. Uh, deal with that. Oh. Well, I know that it's not that way. Oh, yeah, thanks. Because I totally can't aim already. And of course, it's right there. Ah. Good pill. Thanks. Uh, this is, um, Nikar one, right? Yeah. Ah! This is not gonna be fun. Because now I don't actually have stupidly high attack to kill him in time before he does the stupid homing laser attack. So really, all I have to do is hope for the best. I'm like this and just constantly circle around him. And constantly move. Seem to work. <laughs> Tears up, good. I'll just leave you there. Guardian Angel? Well, I haven't gotten that item before. Hey, <laughs> look how cute he is. Mm. Smiling. My icon is a Guardian Angel. How fitting. Vaults? Hope for a vault. Uh, of course it's a really stupid vault. You know, if I go inside a room, I expect a payout. Or a room that- Aw, oh, you! Well, at least the worst part of Ultra Pride is nullified as a lost. Which is just Edmund suddenly vomiting at you. Oh, how fitting, I get to uh, kill Edmund as the lost. Bye! Bouncy tears to mid to death. This is seriously a room in Necropolis. Feels like it should be a cathedral room. Oh well, bouncy tears, Polyphemus. Woo! Yeah, this is a really average run. If I'm actually going to not spend 20 hours in the chest, I need to get something good. Well, actually, come to think of it, I'm going to the chest, not the dark room. So I, well, I do have to worry about double cage and double adversary, but I at least get three items at the start. Hmm. Bounce, bounce, bounce. <clears throat> I saw videos and I thought, um, Guardian Angel didn't uh, speed up the, um, orbital speed anymore. But I guess it does. Oh well, it's faster. Animation looks really fast too. 
and choppy compared to a lot of the animations in this game. Considering it's just two frames. Spider butt? Well, eh. I guess I'll take it over remote detonator because I don't really need remote detonator. I don't- I'm not having a horrible run with Dr. Fetus. I'm just having a run. That's kind of all it is. Um, uh, well, as much stuff as possible. Boom. I love getting- I love, uh, the fact that they make this stuff give out, uh, <coughs> stuff like turrets. And definitely want to go to the store on this floor. Maybe, hopefully, there's an arcade here too. Why are they running away from me? I mean, I have Spider Butt to help me now. It's not the best item. Well, it wasn't the item in the original. I've actually just completely ignored it in rebirth so far. I guess now is the time to see what Spider Buck can truly do. And, uh, Castle Tears almost got me killed there. Alright. Back into this store. There we go. I'm liking. I'm kinda liking my damage. I would prefer some damage ups. Blue map and pssst, magic fingers. Well, magic fingers is a pretty damn good item. And considering I have Polyphemus, it's gonna do pretty good damage. And I now know where all the secret rooms and stuff are. Almost just ran into the blue fire like a douchebag. Uh, probably not going to go out of my way to go to the su uh, super secret because. Uh, it's probably not going to benefit me, considering my current trinket setup is pretty good. Considering, uh, I can get a ton of money, uh, be a lucky rock, plus money becomes useless, uh, in a normal run outside of this floor, Magic Fingers is probably going to be, uh, help here. At least, it's, it's at least going to help. At least, like, to take out smaller enemies and such. Don't serve at all. Uh, can you just like die to the crushers? Good for you. I'm glad that was uh, enemy free room. Lots of money. Good. Good for magic fingers. Also, it looks like I actually am gonna pass by the super secret room. Still haven't found the treasure room either. The magician again? I have this exact room! What is this? I knew it wasn't gonna help me. Treasure room. Oh, I, uh, uh, phew, that was close. I almost didn't notice. I got killed. I was uh, looking at the map. Thought it was uh, safe over the rocks. Yeah, but that should have been a room that I should not have died in. That was just my own stupidity. <laughs> Beep. There's so so much nonsense with bouncy tears. Bounce, 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 bounce. All right, and this is mom. I wish I had blank card again. Oh, I got your fingers off to do. Bounce, bounce, bounce. Ah, 
I should uh, lead mom to stomp over the rocks, so I get free money. When uh, mom comes down, I'll... Ooh! That took off quite a lot of her health bar with just a few uses of magic fingers. <coughs> Unexpected. That was very unexpected. Uh, okay then. Sacred Heart, two runs in a row. Uh, this is beautiful. And I still have one more chance to get Mind or Soul. I'm hoping for them. Espe uh, especially maybe uh, the Soul. Or uh, I prefer either. Both of them would help me. Especially, uh, the mind would pretty much get me to the boss as fast as possible. Maybe soul wouldn't be so good. Oh, that's good. Oh, bounce plus... Oh, bounce plus sacred heart. They bounce and are homing in. So they, like, stick to the enemy for a little bit. That's amazing! And Sue's... Ugh. Of course I get that on a Curse of the Lost Thor. I'd rather have the strength card. Maybe Ansu's? No, probably doesn't. Yeah, of course I get Ansu's on this floor. Go up, good golden poop. Good for magic fingers. Or, well, I probably will get counterfeit coin. Uh, bouncy tears. <coughs> oh. Oh, I didn't. Uh, magic fingers will definitely be helpful for entering mom's heart, because then I could just immediately kill all the eyeballs. Your magic fingers is probably going to be amazing <clears throat> because I have a polyphemus and sacred heart, which is like wonder this is wonderful. And my tears aren't too shabby either. for this, considering I've pretty much mastered Altar 4 now. Let me see if I can do Bouncy Tear shenanigans to kill the uh, guy without actually having to get close to him. Or I could let Guardian Angel take care of him. Yeah. Coughing. Um. Oh, library. That's a surprise. Ooh, a bunch of cards. Per throw. Ooh, two clubs, two hearts. Oh, hey, this wasn't the uh, track for the original. Dang. I want to use per throw. I mean, maybe if I get a undesirable. I'll carry around Perthro in case I get an undesirable angel or uh, boss drop. Or devil, heck. Uh, and then after that, I will go and pick up the strength card. Because I want to save it for uh, Blue Baby. Just to either 
Reduce the pain or kill him faster. all that much. Oh well. Livable. <clears throat> maybe maybe I should have had a custom soundtrack going so you're not hearing all the time. Eh. It's just I would have set it up but uh, didn't want to really do Winamp or whatever Smite uses. And I didn't want to. Ooh, almost got me killed. And I didn't want to um, spend 20 minutes finding music, because I like a lot of music. So I probably would have ended up adding like the entire uh, Paper Mario soundtrack. like searching for the super secret. Yeah, like they bounce and then try and home in on stuff. That's cool. Expecting more. Oh, guess not only two in this room. Bow bouncy and homing is great. Alright. Considering I'm um, uh, having a great room right now. I'm just going to say magic fingers for uh, Isaac and uh, Mom's heart. And whatever this boss is. Probably maybe Mr. Fred, because then I can just kill all his minions immediately. Let's see. Daddy Long Legs? When have I seen you? Well, I actually just saw you last run of the chest, but as an actual boss, that's you. You're just gonna use that attack over and over. Uh, a snack? Well, I wanna use Perthra on that again! Another HP up, and the Angel Room refuses to show up. Most undesirable uh, thing to get out of Perthra ever. Uh, thanks, Perthra. You're a true friend. It's not like it's going to harm me or anything. Arcade, I think I'm going to leave it. So, um, so I have as much money as possible for magic fingers, so I can spam the hell out of it during Isaac and Blue Baby. I don't even want to deal with those pills. Uh, well, two rocks here. Uh, bunch of pills. More pills. Wonderful. Is there a light? Let's see forever here. I I'm just not even gonna bother. I don't want to be getting any stat downs. Oh, envy. Wonderful. I wonder how Sacred Heart bouncy tears. Ooh, ooh, just there. Pretty much just beats him. Whoa. Mysterious paper, yes. Give me an on hit trinket. Loving how uh, Sacred Heart reacts with uh, rubber cement.
Yeah, I pretty much have to use it there. Wow, it shook the screen. I don't, does that normally happen? Like, shook the screen hard, I think. Eh, whatever. Wow, I can pretty much auto-clear rooms. Ah, again, I'd rather save it for uh, Isaac and Mom's heart where I can just spam the hell out of it. A uh, pin? Bye! <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> I wonder if I could actually kill the mom hands up there with uh, magic fingers. Alright, time's for mom's heart. That was close. Uh, was mashing a five instead of all to four. Yeah, that was close. Considering that enemy invulnerability is not exactly a huge thing in this game, I might as well just come in and mash the button. That worked. <laughs> okay. Uh, that seemed to work rather well. I swear, I want to highlight- I want to highlight the Sacred Heart stuff and, of course, me just coming in there and mashing the button and killing Mom's heart with no effort. Not even getting the chance to attack. Oh, the chest is gonna be so fun. Gonna murder every boss. More money? Sure, give me more money to mash, uh, to use to mash the space bar as hard as I can. <laughs> this is actually the first time I've been in the cathedral is lost. Money? Lots of money! Ooh, into the 60s. 70s, actually. Oh, I'm gonna have fun on Isaac. <laughs> and the one tear is stuck to him. That's wonderful. I'm loving this. This is like the best combo I've had. Uh, but not the best, probably the most fun combo I've had. Oh yeah, no thank you. Oh, uh, yes please, blow up the rocks so I can get for more free money. Uh, probably, yep, that's the last rock. And murderize. Get murderized. Murderer. Murderer. Yes, I'm totally give up magic fingers for Bob's rotten head. Just take out half their health. Please drop money. Ooh, uh, well, I got my money back. Eh, I'd rather keep strength. That's been more reliable than me. Or, well, I never even used the Empress, so it doesn't matter. In the last run. Just, he just got confused. He ran away. Well, might give me something useful. Oh uh, yeah, you suck. I just got that item. Oh well, it's not that many uses out of magic finger. Okay, that was close again. Uh, hit Alt E that time. Yeah, but that was just random. Couldn't really have prevented that. Almost two hours now. Uh, yeah, uh, 
yeah, I don't want to feed you. Because you give me... Okay, sure, I'll just use the money I used to feed the beggar in order to kill Daddy Longlegs before he can even have a chance to kill me. Uh, empty room. Wonderful. Alright, chain reaction! Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at that cash. And I can even, uh, just come in here and... I don't even care! Just go <laughs> be, uh, utterly crushed. Eat magic fingers. Don't even care anymore. <laughs> ah, three pennies to use after Isaac. Uh, I'll just blow you up and hopefully get some extra money. Eh, sure, got my bomb back. Whatever. I'd rather have the 99 coins for magic fingers instead of the, the fortune teller, which probably won't help me, because Lucky Rock and Flatworm are really... Alright, match! That worked out well. Uh, okay. Uh, so if he doesn't uh, go and do dumb, it's me with... Okay, survive this one. Okay. Barely uh, did that one, so I think I'll just run in and mash magic fingers. Don't stop. Because Isaac is too random for me. Blue baby is better. So. Or, well, actually, I'll probably just be able to mash magic fingers and kill him, too, because I'll use the strength card as soon as I enter that room. Alright. Okay. That worked out very well. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. Oh, I forgot to pick up the pennies. Isaac's heart in basement? Sure, good, all well. Chest! Alright, let's get this. Uh, Sister Maggie, Mouthpad, Unicorn, Deadbird. Uh, you three suck. Why are you here? Or, well, they're not useful as a loss, considering Magic Fingers is the greatest thing ever and nothing can stop me. Oh! Yeah, screw that. Not dealing with that room. Double bloat? Ah uh -huh, no thanks. And, uh, double adversary and cage will probably receive that treatment as well. Oh. Oh, Jesus Christ. This is a giant room with, like, five sins, isn't it? Four. Now watch Gluttony drop bucket of lard. Yep, I would love D6 right now. Because I would uh, be able to reroll those three items. Ah, uh, Perthar room, why did you- Or why did I have to abandon Perthar? Okay, more money. Cash money. Guillotine, uh... Uh... That item is really disorienting a lot, and it's not necessarily <laughs> beneficial or harmful, it's just really disorienting. Uh... Oh, hi, Haunt. First time I've seen you in a long while. You know what I can say to you? Eat magic fingers.
What else was I gonna do? <laughs> Double cage? Automatic master. I'd rather save my money in here. As effortless as magic fingers makes these moves. Uh, oh, hi! Uh, now I know where the boss is, but I would have found him anyways. Oh, sure, Bob's curse. Let's just get in more things. I don't really like this room. Hell, Blue Navy's probably going to be murdered in seconds because... Er, hello. Uh, hold on. Uh, I'm probably just gonna walk in and murder Blue Navy. Because I'm gonna activate strength card and then proceed to mash the space bar. Wait, red chests don't... Oh yeah, obviously they don't, because in dark room it actually give you free items. Nyuk nyuk. <clears throat> I don't even care. <laughs> I have this, unless Boo Baby has a trump card. And I might as well check the secret room. Nothing else to do on this floor. Bertha rune. Uh, red chest is not going to help me. Oh, I can see forever twice. Yeah, wonderful. Alright, let's go. I am highlighting that. That's what I'm highlighting. <laughs> uh, bravo! Good game! Oh, I, I, I fucking unlocked Godhead. Eat shit, Edmund. Fuck you, the lost. I will never play as you ever again until the expansion. Well, I'm gonna take a break, just leave it on that. <laughs>